Well, Colorado's dinosaur footprints are slowly starting to fade away. Erosion from weather is erasing what time simply cannot. Well, your Jefferson County reporter Rick Sander takes us out to Dinosaur Ridge. This is where the dinosaurs roamed. The evidence left behind in their footprints for all to relish today. These tracks here were made by living animals. This is a snapshot in time 100 million years ago. The existence of the footprints wasn't known until fairly recently, when you consider the span of time. As soon as these rocks were exposed in 1937 during the construction of the Alameda Parkway, then immediately they started to degrade. It is a place to educate and try to preserve the very distant past. This year we've had abundant rain and snow, well, sleet actually, and, and hail. So what they do is they fade away. 21st century drones are being deployed to figure out how best to protect those footprints where the dinosaurs used to live. And now what we're doing is using technology which gets better and better every year uh, to make a super high resolution image. The loss of the footprints can't entirely be blamed on nature. Man has played a role too in the past. And you can still see evidence of people just getting out here with a hammer and chisel and trying to remove tracks from the surface and take them home. With help from the drones, they plan to create a three-dimensional map of the dinosaur footprints. That image will be used to examine erosion over the next few years and perhaps learn more about how dinosaurs once ruled the world. Rick Salinger, covering Colorado First. We have so many questions, Rick. We need yes. to catch up with him in the newsroom we and ask do. him more. Well, Rick puts his decades of experience as a journalist to work in Jeffco. He lives there. So if you have a story idea for him, we sure hope you'll call him. You can also email him at cbscolorado.com.